Okay, welcome back with me, Rema. Today, I want to talk to you about projection. Projection is a part of Klaus complex. In SFL, or Systemic Functional Linguistic, projection links Klaus by having one process projected through another or either by quoting or reporting. Both meanings or ideas and wording or locutions can be projected. A projected wording is marked with speech mark and a projected idea is marked with apostrophe. We can also project presupposition or information or proposal or goals and service. Projection occur through mental and verbal process. As you know guys, verbal process is process of saying. Like I said, he said, like that. And mental process like a process of thinking. Like I thought, I think, like that. In verbal process, uh, process of saying, right? Process of saying. Uh, it means uh, verbal process projected wording or locution. Right? So, we can uh, say that verbal process uh, ca we can mark with speech mark. And mental process we can mark with apostrophe. Okay? Okay, for example, in verbal process, there is two clauses. The first one is the conductor said, and the second one is the next concert is in July. The second clause we can mark by speech mark because uh, the, the next concert is in July. Uh, project the first clause. Project what? the conductor said and why uh, we use speech mark because this is process of wording or locution right so uh, in verbal process the conductor said the next concert is in July the second clause is project what the conductor said okay so uh, do you understand guys uh, okay. Uh, this clause can stand alone, right? Because this clause is independent. Independent clause. Independent clause is uh, a clause can be stand alone. Uh, the conductor said it can stand alone, right? Is independent clause. The next concert is in July is independent clause okay the second uh, example the conductor said the next concert is in July the, uh, the conductor said that the next concert is in July what is the difference between uh, first example and second example right the difference is that because that uh, the second class become a uh, independent class that the next concert is in July that uh, make the second class become a uh, independent class uh, and in mental process, example, for example, in mental process, mental process is process of uh, process of thinking, right? So, uh, for example, uh, like I thought, I think that it uh, that means that means uh, mental process, okay? For example, I thought the next concert is in July. 
I thought the next concert is in July. Fomento process is process of meanings, right? Process of idea. We can mark the second clause by apostrophe. I thought the next concert is in July. The second clause project what I thought. What I thought, right? The the next concert is in July. Project what I thought. Okay. I thought the next concert is in July. It uh, there is a two class, right? I, the first one is I thought, and the second one, the next concert is in July. That class uh, include to the dependent class, right? I thought it independent it dependent class right okay do you understand guys uh, so in verbal process this process of saying uh, for anal analyze that clause uh, include verbal or mental we can we have to remember that Verbal process is process of saying, and mental process is process of thinking, right? Uh, for analyze that verbal or wording or locution, use speech mark in the second class. Like the conductor said, the next concert is in July. We analyze that. The next concert is in July. We have to uh, use speech mark in second clause. Okay? And mental process. I thought the next concert is in July. The second clause, uh, we have to use uh, apostrophe. Apostrophe. So we can conclude that projection is process of projected something or process of what come next what will come in the next clause uh, for example like i said what will come to the next clause i said what will come to the next clause okay that is projection the next clause projected the first class that is projection guys so i hope you understand what i said what i told to you guys uh, i hope this will be uh, useful for you and thank you so much for watching and see you for the next video i never made it but I know I did